Nearly 700,000 veterans in Michigan and many of them could be suffering unnecessarily. Later this morning, the Genesee County Veterans Stand Down, as it's called, will take place in Flint, bringing important resources to those who need them. NBC 25's Ilse Lujan Hayes joins us live from downtown Flint with more. Ilse? Good morning, everyone. Right now, we are live at University Pavilion, just across the street from the Riverfront Banquet Center. Now, we're just a couple of hours away from the setup for the event, but joining us right now is Miriam Marks McCone. Thank you so much for joining us. Now, this is a huge collaboration between My Brother's Keeper, um, U of M Flint, and a couple of other, you know, organizations. Tell us about the event and why it's so important. Um, the event will have free food for everyone, for our veterans. We're trying to make it a community event along with our veterans. We'll serve um, homeless veterans and veteran families in need with services such as um, VA benefits, VA health care enrollment, um, Social Security, ID cards, things of that nature. Now let's talk about these resources. You know, we often hear about these types of events happening, but why are they so important? Are there a lot of veterans out there not taking advantage of the resources? It's not that they're not taking advantage of the resources. Some veterans just don't know that they exist. And this is an event that helps our veterans know what's out there and available for them. It also lets the community know how many veterans are present alongside them. Mm -hmm. So it's very important that our veterans are. Now, Miriam, would you say that there is a perception out there that resources aren't getting to veterans or the timing is not as efficient as it should be? What, what do you say to folks? It's not that it's inefficient. It's just that um, the, our veterans aren't aware of all of our benefits that are available. Okay. I'm a veteran myself, and when I first got out of the military, I didn't know that benefits were available. So okay. I don't mean to cut you off. We ran out of time, but we're gonna, you're going to hang out with us. We're going to yes. talk a little bit. Well, we want to make everyone aware. So if you know a veteran, if you're a veteran, let them know. Call them, Facebook them, DVR the segment. The event is today from 9 to 3 here at the University Pavilion in downtown Flint. Live in downtown Flint, Elsie Lujan Hayes, NBC 25. All right, Elsie, thank you. It's called a stand down in downtown Flint today. Well, there are nearly 700,000 veterans in Michigan, and many of them could be suffering unnecessarily. Later this morning, the Genesee County Veterans Stand Down will take place in Flint, bringing important resources to those who need them most. NBC 25's Elsie Luan Hayes joins us now from downtown Flint. Good morning, Brittany. Good morning, everyone. Right now we are live at U of M Flint's University Pavilion, and we're just about an hour away from the event actually getting underway, setting up rather. Now joining us right now is David Corder, who is a veteran. Good morning. Thank you so much for being here. You're welcome. Um, thank you for serving. Tell folks at home when you served. Well, I was uh, in the Navy. I'm one of uh, Jimmy Carter's first all-volunteer force during the uh, post-Vietnam mm -hmm. Uh, era, and I was in for seven years before I was disabled. Okay, let's talk about today's event. Now, you know, among the veteran community, would you say that the, you know, what are they saying? Do they feel that resources aren't available or they are, but access to them is difficult? Tell us about that. Well, I feel that uh, there's frustration in the VA community with uh, many of the vets that I talk to personally, mm -hmm. and a lot of it, I have to tell them, is um, not just the system, which isn't perfect, mm -hmm. but it's also their due diligence. Uh, it, the system kind of requires them to ensure that they take care of themselves, mm -hmm. that they do follow-ups, that they uh, ensure and verify appointments before they go, and that they create relationships within the VA. Uh, this will lead them to further resources and essentially one would call it working the system. Let's talk about today's event. So um, would you say that events like this are critical for the veterans? I do believe they are. And thank my brother's keeper for uh, taking care of us the way that they do. Uh, I'm also involved in one of their in one of their housing programs. Um, an event like this is really important because it allows the establishment of some of those relationships and it allows the vets to come out and meet people face to face before they use the services and it gives them that ability to, um, to have access to things that possibly they wouldn't normally have access to. Okay, thank you so much, David. We appreciate you taking the time this morning to talk to us. So we want to remind our viewers at home, if you know a veteran, let them know. Today's event, the Genesee County Stand Down event, is from 9 to 3 here at U of M Flint Pavilion. For now, we're live in Flint. Elsie Luhan Hayes, NBC 25. Back to you guys. All right, great event taking place a little later today. Thanks so much, Elsie.